All right, deliver the plane to the airfield. The cab's waiting. Look, the cab's waiting for me to take off. Beautiful music. Listen to this music. You are flying in restricted airspace. Turn around immediately. Oh, shit. My eternal brother, brother. You get the secret plane from the secret location? Yeah, I'm in the top secret baby blue plane. Where am I heading? Unknow it, and you'll know. Look, can you just know it for me so we can move this thing along? Okay, but that's entry-level stuff, bro. Sandy Shores Airfield. I'll meet you there. Kiflam. Kiflam. Four fucking stars, man. Four star wanted level for flying over that stupid base. <clears throat> well, let's keep heading this way. Maybe I'll lose the wanted level because no one's after me. Mount Josiah. Ah, oh, fuck. Fuck him. I'm faster than that helicopter. I could lose it. Stay in the mountains. I should be all right. We got rid of him. Nice. Very nice. Stab City? What the hell? We're in Stab City. <laughs> Just remember to do my landing gear. Beautiful music. Oh shit, here's where I gotta land. Okay, nicely done. Very nicely done. Perfect. Perfectly done. <laughs> Just come here a second, dude. Get flying, bro. Get flying. Got the money? Get flying. Cool. In the plane? <laughs> Get flying. Oh, nice. You're almost a thesis of truth, bro. You nearly there? It's gonna cost a little time and effort, and then it's astro planes and 37,000 places all at once. <laughs> <laughs> and the chicks. Oh! <laughs> you know, Chris and I sometimes watch porn together in the nude. Oh! Just to prove we don't get turned on by it. What the hell? Pretty awesome. Anyway, Kiflon, man. Laters. Kiflon. Oh! Chris says, if you're ready, there's a tree of truth. Now he'll arrange a map, but it's kind of expensive to reach this level of existence. You'll need quite a bit of money. Someone will mail you, bro. Mind if I take the plane? <laughs> Keep flying. Keep flying. Sure. You leave me this car. You can take the plane. Okay. Bye. Now what? <laughs> Look, it's the late action. Oh, Zondar the bridge. I guess if I went under a bridge with the plane, I would have got that achievement, huh? Well, quite the view. Shoot the moon. 
It doesn't work. Now what do I do? So let me guess. I have to sleep more. Oh, wait. No, here we go. No, that was pitchers. Damn it. I thought that was them. Shit. Now what do I do? Where do I go now? I gotta go home and sleep. Can he sleep at Trevor's? No, he can't. It doesn't show up as a home for him anymore. That sucks. I'm gonna take a fucking cab, dude. Let me just find a road. What the hell? I can see under the car. Look at this. Cab time. Oh, you know what? People are right. They should just switch to another character. Duh, you're absolutely right. I don't know what I'm doing that for. Let's see where Trevor is. What the fuck? Where's Trevor? He's at the strip club. Okay. Meanwhile, it's a vanilla unicorn. Titties, titties, titties. All right. Sounds good to me. Titties, titties, titties. I like those chiches. If you like me now, you'll love me in the back. Ah, Larry Tupper. It's the next bail bond guy. Larry Tupper. Larry Tupper, and that's a dude, by the way, standing next to me. Okay. Maybe we should do this. I don't, I'm not dancing with that chick. <laughs> it's a dude! It's a man, baby! Would you fucking stop walking like that? Why is there a pizza on the ground? Of half eaten pizza just sitting on the ground. What the fuck? Alright, so let's go to that area here. Alright, it's telling me that he is located. Hmm. Right around there. Oh, the waypoint's still set. Okay. The waypoint is still set. We just gotta grab a cab. I need a cab, pronto. No problem. I'll have one there in a couple of minutes. Wonderful. Mm -hmm. Wonderful. Damn, we gotta change Trevor's outfit. I get tired of the same thing. Then again, the dress wasn't much better. <laughs> oh, wait, there's a cab right there. There's a ton of cabs around here. There's one. The hands-on car wash. Unfortunately, you'll have to wait to ride the T train. This car's too small. France. All right. Let's see how close they can get me. All right, brother, here we are. Christ! Oh. Where the hell am I? An unnamed dirt road between Sonora Road and Baytree Canyon Road. He's to my left, I believe. No, he may actually be to my south.
It's hard to tell from this map. The map is annoying. It shows this weird curving road. I think I need to go further down the road. This way. Up this way. is lucky because you ain't getting none. Bounty hunter! Take them down! I'll oh, kill you! you got shot. Oh, we got a man down! I only just got out! Oh, ah. Screw you! I'm reloading! Ah. Alright. What the fuck? So gently. Get out of the way. Okay, okay, I give up. There we go. Nice. Oh, that's better. Now let's go before I change my mind on the whole <clears throat> dead or alive thing. In now. Nicely done. I just want to party. Wasn't very nice, Larry. Very nice, Larry. Whoa! Hang on. Surely it ain't. Trevor Phillips? Huh? Am I that forgettable? Well, I was pretty messed up back then. And you, well, years ain't been kind to none of us, have they? How you been? Oh, oh, I can't complain. Yourself? You know, up and down. Look, sorry for that back there. Didn't know it was you. Hey, no harm done. Glad to hear it. Ha, well, isn't this pleasant? <laughs> Who needs tires? Seriously, they're overrated. So, seeing as we're old acquaintances, what do you think about giving me a pass this time? All I did was cook up a batch, not even a real crime. You know how it is. Well, let's look at this objectively, shall we? You shot at me, insulted my rugged good looks, and shamelessly gone after my market share. I'd just consider yourself extremely lucky your heart is still beating. <laughs> and not being stomped under my foot right now. Oh yeah, right. I heard about Johnny. Yes. If it wasn't for the fact I'd made a commitment to Maud and have a soft spot for the mature woman. Maud? Oh, hell, she smells like spoiled chicken feet. Maybe you can work your charms on her, see if she'll let you off. 
She's certainly hankering for some male <laughs> company. Uh, 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 uh. No way. I'll take the jail time. <laughs> I'll take the jail time over spending time with Maud. <laughs> Second bail jumper, and I already know the feller. Maybe I need to take audit of my social circle. Well, if I got to go, if I got to go in, who better to go in with than my old pal Trevor? We had some good times, didn't we? No, we really didn't, Larry. <laughs> I sold you drugs. Then I can only assume you started buying drugs off someone else, then started selling your own drugs. These, on their own, do not constitute. Good times. <laughs> we had a real nice cook site this time, too. Next thing you know, whole trailer goes up like a rocket. Must have gotten lazy again with the measurements and the shake and bake. As a wise man once said, rarely does a tweaker a good baker make. Huh? <laughs> right? I still can't rightly believe you're a bounty hunter. If what I heard about them bikers and Ortega's crew is true, I wouldn't have figured you have much time for a sideline. Well, I am diversification personified, or personification diversified, as a psychological evaluation once said. Yes. Say what? Don't worry about it. Look, it's been fun catching up and all, Larry, but I think we've said everything that needs to be said, don't you? Whatever you reckon, Trevor. I could just get out here, seeing as we're stopped and all. Hello, stranger. Who's this? Hello, Maud. Two I down. Found this man wandering the streets, and I thought that maybe you uh, might be able to find him a home. I think I can do that. Anyway, let's not waste all day with the inconsequential chit chat. You'll be receiving a file from me shortly. Very nice. Ten grand. <laughs> Ten grand for that one, huh? Well, two down. Then we gotta see what, uh... What the hell? I can't... Don't you be getting me all hot and bothered now! I'm trying to fucking change characters. It's not letting me. It's seriously not letting me. Finally! It was like stuck. I was holding down, holding down. Nothing was happening. Very weird. <clears throat> Alright, there we go. Oh, where's my where's Michael? What's he doing? Hey baby, you looking for a date? Nope. Just window shopping. <laughs> Happily married now. Window shopping with the hookers, huh? Whoa. So did you ever get the text? No, he never got the text from, uh, Epsilon. What the hell? I guess he has to sleep? What's going on? Yeah. <clears throat> he never got the freaking text. Well, that sucks. Huh. Well, let's see if, uh, what Franklin's doing then. you been eating? I gotta get a regimen for your ass. <laughs> That's a lot of shit. That's a lot of shit. <clears throat> Might as well save too while I'm here. Okay. Let's see now what Michael's doing. All right. 
Hey, listen, baby, that was great. I gotta run now, okay? All right, bye, babe. So long. I think it's nice that Michael has the happy ending, man. <clears throat> Everything works out. He finally, you know, made, made, made peace with his family. They're a unit now. Big Daddy in the house. Let's go change back into my Epsilon robes. That might be part of it, too. What the hell? Let's have him sleep now, and then I'll see if he gets the text. Alright. Aha, it's out there now. See that? The mission appeared. Nice. <laughs> Bicycle. They never sent me any, uh, they never sent me a text or anything. Alright, well, let me guess. It's out in the fucking desert. Of course it's out in the fucking desert. It's always out in the fucking desert with these people. I don't know what the hell their problem is. Alright, cab time. <clears throat> Can you get a cab here as soon as possible? I'm sending one out right now. Okay, thanks for your help. Cab time. And then to the desert with this ridiculous outfit. <laughs> <laughs> 